Hello. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Happy Halloween, everyone. Halloween is one of my favorite events of all time. It's that, it's only... that only time of the year wherein you can be whoever or whatever you want to be. I say whatever because sometimes people dress up as pumpkins or apples or carrots or even cows. But in my case today, I wanted to be a mermaid. I'm not a fan of doll eye lenses, but I'm wearing a pair for this look. I'm also wearing a tube top. Next, I put on my trusty foundation by dotting it all over my face. I usually have a buffing brush to do the work, but today I felt like using a sponge. My brows can go messy so I'm putting glue to keep them in place and yes, I dropped it. Finally got the glue stick locked in my fingers. Now combing my brows to fix the shape. Next I'm contouring with a sponge. I'm going to contour more than I usually do. Putting that a little higher than the hollows of my cheeks to give my face a lift. I'm also going to include my temples. I'm now going to bronze up the same areas I contoured using an angled brush. I'm going for a shimmery look, so I'm going to use this illuminator from Maybelline using the same brush I used for the bronzer. If you put this clip in slow-mo, you will see the pigments flying around. It's crazy. I'm also putting some on my shoulders and clavicles, because I can. I'm so shiny! The color I chose for the brows is violet. I don't know why, it doesn't matter. You'll never know what the mermaid's eyebrow color is like. Do they even have eyebrows? Are their eyebrows like sisters too? <laughs> Sorry. I'm adding some black on the brows now. Let's start some color on the face. I'm starting a shimmery green powder around my eyes. I'm spreading that on the cheeks and I'm also going to run that on my forehead. I'm using the same color as my highlighter. Next up is a darker green. I'm running that on the same areas. Then I'm going over with black. I'm starting to look like a ninja turtle here. Time to line the eyes. Putting black on my water lid and I'm also gonna tight line. 
I want to make sure the rims of my eyes are super black. I'm smudging the lines out using a small brush. I'm kind of winging them out too. Cleaning harsh lines now with a sponge. That's my birthmark. I'm now intensifying the eyes by adding black powder on the lids. And of course, you know, the usual blending and blending. I want it to go weirder, so I'm using a liquid liner to draw squiggly lines around my eyes. I'm going to add more illuminator because you can never have too much shimmer when you're a mermaid. Onto the lips, I have petroleum jelly. Of course, you can use any lip balm you want. This is gonna serve as my base. I'm now using a green shadow first. Now I'm adding light green in the middle. And I'm finishing that with teal. Or you could just say, powder blue, or cyan, or whatever. My least favorite, falsies. So you could stop here if you want, but I won't. I'm gonna add sequins at the top of my brows and in the inner corner of my eyes. If you have shiny jewelry you can put around your neck, then go ahead. I don't have one handy, so I'm gonna draw one. I'm sorry, I have poor eyesight. If I had seen better, I would have made sure I connected all the lines. I'm using blue to add color. I'm also going to add sequins later. And we are done. You could keep your hair up or down. Stay weird. <laughs>